Welcome back to episode 28. I know for sure. sure right. I know for sure on this one of Kingdom Death, the Dragon People of Stars. People of Stars. Campaign. Yes. Right. All right. It's been a while, but we're back. Well, it's always been a while, every time. Well, last week, yeah. We were off by a week. But we're down. This is four episodes left. Four. That's what I said. Uh, and this is really the last... It might not be, but this is the last fight that we get to select. It might not be? What do you mean? Well, because we could go fight another antelope, lion, oh, okay, if we okay. want. But we want to oh, you wanna... appease the fans Yeah. and fight the lion god yeah, again. Yes, right. And I don't think we're going to gain anything from him, but we just want to fight him. Yeah. Okay. I want to see it. Well, we, we went into that fight really... We, we didn't even really get we to didn't, We didn't get to the fight. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, today we're going to do a level 2 antelope. Now, the reason why we're doing a level 2, uh, again, it's possible that we're not getting any basic resources from him. So, we would, we're aiming to get at least 6 resources, like antelope resources, right. uh, but he also has the highest chance to get resources from critting. Okay. That's why we selected him, and not a level 3, because Tarek is going out on this fight. So Tarek just has to hit this antelope with his spear once. It will ding him to be a weapon master. Right. And then become a person People of the stars. stars. But he'll have max hunt experience. Right, which is why we got the ring. Right. Well, I was just set, was setting it up. Oh. Setting it up. But yeah, now then he'll be okay. He'll be able to fight. Then he'll later. be able to go out. Right. So if we happen to fight a level three antelope, and God forbid, somehow Tarek dies. Yeah. You know, it's just not worth Why it. Why would you say that? It's just not worth it. So let's fight a level two. Kind of play it safe. Uh, get as many resources. We need two hide uh, to complete the leather set. So to we'll have four one. armor sets. Yes. Right. Right. So that's that's really what we're looking for from from fighting this antelope, uh, and it should just be a nice you know. The fight's going to be... We control. I hope so. I mean, we got to do the overwhelming darkness, which has not been great for it's us. Not, it has not been. Uh, but we will... Uh, make the best of it? Yeah, we'll, we'll make the best of it. And we have the plus one luck because the story... From last year, yep. Ah. So that's helping our crit to get more resources. And it has been pointed out that Nocturne, who went into the last fight, since he has a rejuvenation suit, healed all his permanent injuries. I love people who watch this. I yes. love people who watch the videos. So... Uh, Unfortunately, everyone from the last fight had to skip this event, or else right. I would have brought him out again, because he's just an awesome tank. He's great. And the reason why he couldn't be a tank anymore was because he couldn't wear waist armor. Right. But now that that healed, <laughs> he can come be a tank for yeah. the Lion God. He's going to tank that Lion oh, God. Poor up. guy. Okay. Uh, so, I erased all of his permanent injuries. Well, that was a big thing, and there was another one, too. We Well, that was the last video. We can skip the Bone Witch. So, don't yes. throw the Bone Witch coming back. So, yep. that was huge, another huge fan. Absolutely. Thing. Thank you. Two things I just want to get out of the way, because we've never actually done it, was roll for Rumble and Nocturne's um, age abilities. Right. So okay. we're going to do that right now. I'll roll for Noc. You do Rumble. Okay. Uh, this is their first age, so five plus one permanent strength. That would have been. That brings him to zero. And 12? 12. Am I supposed to? Yeah. 12. <laughs> You're right. Sorry. Mm, a random fighting art. Uh -huh. Well, he doesn't. Rumble could use one, so it's cool. Okay. Well, we have we'll all have the cards. Yeah, we'll do it later because he has okay. all the cards. Get rid of that. We'll keep on the side. Okay. Perfect. So that's the age. Uh, I think that's that's it. Let's see. Um, for anyone who's following any of our other videos, we are coming near the end to our near and far campaign. You've got a lot of people commenting on that. It's a great game. It's very good. I mean, it's a really. I like it. It seems cool. I, I don't know. I like you, haven't, you haven't played it I've yet. I've watched it, but no, okay. I haven't played it yet. Okay. And we're in the middle of doing a escape room experience. Yeah, I'm excited for that. unlock game. So uh, I think we're going to have two physical teams do it. And then hopefully I can do a whole like side-by-side and we can see what team gets the furthest. Right, my team will be the, maybe, will be the last. Yeah. Maybe. I am not a part of a team, so... Maybe your team has a chance. Okay. Wow. Okay. Maybe you have a chance. <laughs> uh, so s stay tuned for that. That should be out uh, maybe sometime early next week. Okay. Because you're coming by. Yeah, we're going to be here days. this week. Yeah. Okay. Good. So stay tuned for that. Pokemon Go is great. And now we're going to show you who we're bringing out. 
first up is Vayne. We haven't used her in quite some time, but since we don't want to use our people of stars <clears> for this fight, and all the survivors from our last one can't come out, we had to go back to our second tier character. So, nothing new with this uh, range class character. Next we have Leona. She's coming back out as our dodge tank. Again, she's just really set up here with some great dodge. I actually have been able to maximize my tank board, finally. So no it's weapons. No weapons. Dodging. Uh, yeah, so it's like plus three evasion here, plus the bonus two. She has one, so that what, three, I can't count already. Four, five, six, six evasion. And I think Tarek, who will eventually take on this, this role, he has two evasion. Yes. So he's going to have plus seven evasion Woo. for the final fight. I'm excited. I'll be controlling Caitlyn, who will be doing the sword, all of our damage, hopefully. I'm um, just using the black sword Vagabond armor. She has the, got the combo master, so when she does a perfect hit on an attack, she rolls one additional attack roll, and that's really... That's that's our damage dealer. Nothing has really changed there either. And Tarek, we're... I, I guess we should have probably put more armor on him because we want to protect him, but... We gave him the hazmat shield, which is plus two armor everywhere, and the dragon vestments, which is one everywhere. So that should really help, and we have to make sure we get that hit. But with Champion's Right and Faded Blow, mm -hmm. we should definitely get that hit I with him so. to give him the Weapon Master and Spear, which I'm going to have to look at, which I think is for traps, the, weapon, the proficiency. Yep, it is. So. What is uh, what's his armor all around? Uh, he's actually not bad. He's got eight in the head, five yeah. arms, eight body. Six waist, five legs. Yeah, that's pretty good without having Woo! real armor on. Yeah, well, he's got iridescent hide, which yeah. is going to help, which is really helping as well. So, and with sweet battle, he should be not spending so much survival. He'll be able to surge all the time and um, hopefully get a wound. Hunt board. I'm not happy with This it. might be one of the last hunts that we go out on, right? So no! This and Lion God, so. Yeah. And we, we don't have the reroll. Because remember, that was the same year that the line, uh, the witch came and we lost okay. all of our survival, so we don't have that. Uh, so we're going to start with Tarek. Skittish. Panicked by the overcoming survivors, the screaming antelope moves one space away from no! the survivors on the hunt board. But it can't run away from us, right? We have that thing we that stops it. We have that thing that stops it, okay. yeah. Oh, and don't forget we can do the lantern, but um, I would do it maybe after. after. Yeah. Uh, so r roll a random. I've never done any of the antelope, so this is all new to me. Oh, you haven't fought it this no, year? No, ever. Oh, ever? Never. We, You've never fought an antelope? No, you have been fighting it in your previous game. I've never fought it. Oh, it's going to be a cool fight for you then. Yeah. That's why I asked. Oh. I like, what is this? Well, welcome to the Screaming Antelope. 39? Right, white goes first? Yep. Yeah, so I'm a little excited. I mean, I'm not really watching this... The yeah, he has, but he's we'll see. he's really not that bad. Um, a level one kind of sucks, uh, but when you start doing level twos, level two um, white lion I think is harder because he hits everyone around him. This okay. guy can just he like runs at you in a certain direction, uh, but you have the ability to to dash away. So, okay, uh, thirty nine. Oh my goodness, Gregalope. A massive antelope stands outside the horizon. Uh, its ancient body bloated with tumors and scar tissue. Its milky eyes catch a sight of the survivors, and it bounds away, driven by a sudden desire. The survivors give chase. The event revealer rolls 1d10 and adds any base speed attributes to the result. You might have a minus one. I don't have any. Okay. All right. <laughs> well, roll it up. Four. No speed. The Gregalope is far too fast. It's gone <laughs> before you know it. Uh, was I close? You You need a 12 or more, basically. Oh my gosh. Uh, wow. That doesn't count the speed in the weapon, right? No. Wow. Oh, base speed attribute. Yes, speed, not movement. Yeah, that's what, that's what I figured. Oh, you have zero. Yeah, I don't have uh, anything. I have, I have a weapon with speed. Okay, on. Well, yeah, you needed a 12 or more. <laughs> Oh That's gosh. crazy. Okay, well, not that bad. Uh, yeah, nothing bad. Happens. Nothing bad. That's fine. Ran another random. 66. Now, we did, did we do the thing where we, um, we can re-roll the certain events, right? That's what I just said. No, we did not. Oh. 
Yeah, because we lost our endeavors. That oh, um, yeah. Sixty six is one number away from number of the beast, and that doesn't sound good. What's number of the beast? Another another six. Oh, okay. It's like sixty seven. What are you talking about? See, one number away. Shh. Okay, forbidden word. There is a great rush of air followed by a booming voice. Oh boy. A word is spoken in an unknown language by an inhuman voice. Did I just say that? Just for an instant, the survivors understand. All non death survivors. I think, which is all of us. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Oh. Gain plus one understanding and suffer one brain event damage. Oh. Oh boy, insane non death survivors also gain a random disorder. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, so one brain. That's a light for me. And an understanding. Oh, an understanding, All right. I, I do something. I awake over here. And I'm maxed over there. You awake? I'm awakened on, awoken on Caitlin. All right, let's uh, let's get that out of the way then. Yeah, so we don't have to do it later. Okay. But I did take a light brain injury, which is not good. Mm -mm. Okay, a week D ten. Nine. You. Nine. Oh. Gain plus one permanent evasion. Whoa. And champions right. That's great. Okay, uh, but now. We have to gain disorders, huh? Uh, not me. It says insane people. Insane. Are you not insane over I'm here? I'm not insane. My two guys are. My goodness. Yeah, I have Quixotic, so if I was insane, mm -hmm. I would gain that, but I'm not. Okay. And what would the order be if you, do you take the damage first and then you're still insane, or is it before insane, taking the damage? Say you were at three, you take the damage down to two, now you're not insane. I um I don't even want to think about that right now, because it didn't it didn't pertain. I would have to reread it. Oh, you had a lot of. Well, now I'm at three and uh, I'm at five, okay, so. Okay. That's something to worry about. Leo is indecision. If you are the event revealer or hunt event that calls on you to make a roll, roll twice and use the lower result. Oh no, that's you. So I'm gonna get rid of. Oh, should I get rid of honorable? Or, no, I want to get rid of Megalophobia so she can go fight. Yeah, Langa. possibly. What, what do you mean possibly? You think she's not going to make it? No, she's not going to fight it then. We have we have better people. Since she's B class to you, we have some. These are good people out In here. In vain, destined. We all know what that is. These are very good people. Like Tarek is very good. He's been we use them a lot. Yeah, but he's the. The B squad, as you said. Terry did not know he's a person you with stars. You said that before. But wait, he's not. Mm. He's the, almost the lead. Anyway. He's almost the lead. Okay. All now, right, now Leo. Devoured grounds. The stone face ground is littered with the leavings of ravenous passing beast. Half eaten acanthus plants are strewn everywhere. If any survivor is three plus understanding, the survivors may skip the next hunt phase. Otherwise, roll. Let's skip it. Yeah, why not, right? Okay. So we're skipping this one. That was not oh, bad. Yeah. Not bad. I thought we were gonna get some acanthus plants. Oh, random event. Does it skip you? I'm gonna go to vein. No. It doesn't skip you. One, okay. Six yeah. D. Man. Oh, it's on the same page. Wildfire. A massive wall of flame confronts the survivors. Beyond it, a path of destruction. Archive any hunt event cards in the next two hunt spaces. The fire has destroyed whatever awaited the survivors. Wow. The next two hunt spaces will be especially chaotic. Roll twice on the hunt event table before moving through. Oh, resolving God. each one at a time. Oh my goodness. I thought it was going to be good. Yeah. And it was bad. Okay. Well, <clears throat> Ooh, that might have been bad. All right, so now we are on overwhelming darkness. So I know we have to split our guys up again. We actually have not dealt with this that often. No, because I hate it, and I make you fight level ones. <laughs> you do. Okay, insane survivors walk the path of insane. 
So I know Vane is and Leo. You guys are not insane. Not insane. Uh, sane survivors with yes. three or more courage. Yes and yes. Okay. Like the path of the brave. All right. Uh, yeah, D10. This is for Tarek. And we can add, I think, plus one to this. Why? Uh, one of our innovations. I will tell me. I will, uh, I think, I think I so. Mean... I think Song of the Brave does it, actually. Let's see. Uh, Leo and Bane. Well, let's see if it actually even would have helped. Oh, I think it would help. Well, it doesn't help me over here, and it doesn't help me over here, so... That's not helpful, then. Yeah. Song of the Brave. Add plus one to the rolls. Okay. It doesn't okay. help me. So, here... Five. Uh, minus one accuracy token. Okay. And ten. Eleven! Oh, you will survive no matter what it takes. Gain sur one survival. Maxed already. And an evasion token. Okay. Okay, evasion and accuracy. I am a six. Um, you lash out on uh, scene. All other survivors suffer one event damage to to a random hit location. Okay. Well, so everyone takes one. You or legs, me? The three of us. Why? Just not me. I'm like I'm like kicking you. So the legs. How many? Just one. And the next is four. You shriek in the darkness, dealing one brain event damage to all non-death survivors. Dude. Careful. I'm I'm taking a severe then. You don't you don't take severe in this. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. So uh, one brain, and I have to take a foot. Okay. That's not that bad. Well, now minus two accuracy on Tarek. Oh, no. Yeah, it's a big. He needs to get hit. He's got champions right. Can I have my tokens before I forget? You can. Minus one accuracy, plus one evasion. Uh, evasion accuracy. doesn't really help. Oh. Evasion and accuracy. All right, so don't forget. All right, so now we have to do two double events. Yeah, because you did the stupid wildfire. Mm. I did do that, didn't I? Nineteen. Oh, so this is like four. So we missed one, but then we have to do two. I know. Oh yeah, yeah. Exhalation of darkness. The survivors are enveloped in a steamy darkness that dims their lantern lights. While stumbling in the muggy dark, each survivor suffers from heat exhaustion, losing one survival. Mm. If any survivor has zero survival, okay, no. Every survivor must roll 1d10. The lowest scoring survivor becomes a straggler. Oh, no, that doesn't sound good. And I think I have to roll twice with her. Okay, I'll have like five. Okay. Tarek is a three. Oh god. Okay, well, roll a d10. Six. The water is... That's not the right one. Six. You're struck from behind by a flailing survivor. Suffer one event damage to the head. <laughs> you get hit in the head. Get beaten up. Okay. Right, so. so that's not. that wasn't too bad. That's not bad. I thought he was going to walk away or leave him. Yeah, that would not be good. <clears throat> yeah. We would not play this game anymore. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we the next one. Then, yes. In the same spot. Twenty six. Pit. The ground beneath the event revealer's feet give way, oh, and no. they plummet into a pit below. You have to roll on the table. One d ten. Yes. Nine. Whoa. You land at the bottom with a soft thud. Suffer one event damage to a random hit location. Okay. Body. Oh. Okay. Sorry, right, I got seven left. <laughs> You're over here. That's the event revealer. No. Why? You do he two does. here. Or does it go one, two? I think it goes one, two. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, Leo, 67. Uh, Six. Ooh. Saliva pools. The ground ahead is pockmarked with pools filled with a gooey liquid. The pools bubble merrily and stink of digesting meat. As the survivors move between the pools, they are overcome by waves of nausea. Each survivor rolls a 1d10. Oh boy. Nine. 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 
If the result is less than their current survival, they continue on. It's no. Not. If the result is greater, they vomit into a nearby pool, suffering one event damage to the body and gain an understanding. They okay. They witness the pool greedingly dissolving their vomit. Ooh. If any survivor has three plus understanding, they devise a way to use the pools. Each survivor may place one gear in a pool, archive the item, and is lost. The survivor gains a resource used to craft that gear. I've got bone darts over here. Wow. Um, I think we all have... I can get rid of these bone darts. I wouldn't really get rid of anything else. Maybe that stupid harp that you wanted. I hate that stupid thing. Yeah, but we might need that against like the final boss. If, he has, if he has like a mood, <laughs> it might be pretty good. Well, we can get rid of the bone darts. Okay. What does the bone darts take, though? I think it's just one bone. Oh, we don't want bone. Yeah, and it's basic anyway, so no, we might no. lose it. So we'll uh, do it. But I gain understanding, right? And Yeah, whoever vomited. Well, both Leo and Vane vomited, and they gain max understanding. Sweet. Which is White Secret. And you rolled for the damage. I took one damage, right? Yeah. It's the body. To the body. Uh, and we don't do White Secret, actually. Right, because it's a sword. Things. But we get Max Understanding. Stupid sword. I wish it didn't let us do the, um, the, the See the Truth one. So wow, Vane we'll... really just needs Scar. She would become a, a people. Go talk to the guy. Yeah, it might be worth it. I know. Okay. Um, you rolled again, right? I need one more roll, and then we're there. 18. <gasps> Dead weed. You find a strange plant growing from the eyes of a stone face. The survivors try to harvest it by rolling on the table below. If any has the bone, sickle, add plus two. We don't. We do not. We just roll a d10? Yeah. I don't know if we all do, I guess. I guess we all do, right? Sure. Because it doesn't say, like, the survivors is the survivors. Six is our highest. Oh, event revealer. Okay, three. One through seven. Okay. Try as you might, you cannot pull out the deeply re rooted... The deeply rooted weed. Okay. Well, we make it to the envelope. Not, not a bad hunt for it. Uh, two terrain has to come out. Giant stone face, lava. Oh, three stone columns. Boring. But not bad. Safe. Not bad, yeah. Set it up and I'll show you how the antelope fight works. I don't know what I'm doing with my hand. Okay, uh, board set up. So he has all these acanthus plants and he usually can go and, and eat these at the end of his turn. Um, well, his basic action is going over here and eating them and he heals. Uh, and they, they're set up there. And so it's every turn he does, he can do that? Well, that's if he... Oh, his basic action. His basic okay. action. So usually his basic action comes into play if we're too far away from him. Okay. And then at the end of the turn, he does this whole diabolical move where uh, he targets a random person in this zone and just runs towards them. But and you, he goes through you, he doesn't he goes, stop he on you. He goes through you and he tramples you. Which oh, so he hits damage. you and continues moving. Yep. yep. Oh, boy, okay. You got it. Uh, so let's... Oh, the monster starts first. I don't know. He does. You tell me. I think so. Okay. Uh, back kick. Target in blind spot, closest threat, in range, so there's no target, so he does the graze. So that's what he does. He moves towards the closest acanthus plant, right here. Eats <coughs> it, heals, but he has nothing to heal. Okay. And then the only person in his arc right here is our tank. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Full moves. Stops right there. He only moves eight. Yes. Okay. Movement eight. Cool. Yep. So he just comes. He just wants to come say hi. Okay. Uh, I I guess start. We start with the arrow. Like yeah. Normal every time. Always. Always. Okay. So I'm gonna go first with uh, Vane. She does have champions right with max understanding. So one shot. Shoot from where I am. There it is. Six. Cool. So if you don't mind pulling that hit card, and I will get the. Minus evasion. Hit locate. I don't know which card to pull. AI hit? What? Have you played this game before? I don't. The black one. The AI That's card. his move. Yeah. Hit location. Oh. he's No, he can't have this many health. No, this is his health. Yeah. I'm seeing where I, hit, where I oh, shot him. Oh, that's why I got all messed up. 
Delicate inverted knee. If you hit with a club or shield, yeah, so you want to fight these guys with clubs and shields. Not happening. Get bonuses. Not happening. No. Alright. Oh, so you get two lock. Oh, okay. That would have been great. We do have shields over here. Okay. Oh, it does say block. Oh, that's pretty good. Alright, so six. Minus one strength. Five. So toughness is five, ten. So I just need a five to wound him. Alright, one wound. Down to sixteen. Cool. And um, I can surge to look at the top three to just you try and get crits lined up. You don't up. move though with that arrow. You do not move. I do not move. Correct. Okay. Oh, but you're not in the way anyway. I'm going in with the sword. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna. Or should I go in with the spear and just try to hit real quick? I want to. I want to hit with the spear first. I think. Okay. Yeah. But then you know what? I am gonna surge then. Okay. If we want to get this hit out of the way. Right. We don't want to pull, like, okay, super dense, dense we yeah. have, persistent injury. He does have minus two uh, accuracy. Okay. Oh, it doesn't matter, because I'll use champions right now. We're good with, with all these. Okay. You're fine. All right, going in. Okay. Two. Um, I do have reach. Okay. Or do I go here? So I'm not within oh, yeah. his arc, right? That's a good idea. Okay. So we're still away. We we're in frame? Uh, yes. All right. Look at that. I don't know what you pressed. What do you mean? I didn't press anything. There we go. See? All good. Oh, okay. All right, so I moved to I'm here. I'm going to mm -hmm. dagger. I got my reach. So I'm going to go. I got speed two with the celestial spear. And you do a champions. Champions right. Yep. Um, I got a hit. Speed two, you get two hits. Two attacks. Oh. Alright. Two shots. The restless ear and the giant teeth. So, you have... Weapon proficiency, right? Uh, yeah. With the spear. The basic one. The basic one. That's what I, yeah, I think it's the traps or something. It's silly. The spear one's really dumb. There you go. I'm attacking with the spear if you draw a trap, yeah. Cancel the trap, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Okay. So it's, do you want to hit him in the teeth or the ear? I just want to hit him to do a, to, to get my weapon proficiency. Okay, so you hit him in the teeth. Uh, I'm going to do Faded Blow. Okay. So plus two strength. Plus two strength and devastating one. Okay. Toughness ten. So I need um, four... Five, six. So you I don't need... Have any... You have strength on you? You have two no, strength on you? Oh, no. Well, you're not that strong. No, not at all. I'm getting two from Feet of Blood. Okay. So, a four. Nope. Wow, you were really not that strong, Ted. No! Wow, okay. Okay, Feet of Blood failed. Alright, now you're hitting him in the ear. That doesn't hit that either. Doesn't either. Oh my goodness. That's not good. All right, well, you should surge for free yes. and attack again. Yeah, cause... let's do that. Wow, dude. Um, five. Yeah. Minus one, so four. Oh, you have ac minus one accuracy. So Three. It's... So that's it. You need fives to hit. Oh, uh, I need fives. Yeah, so just one. Okay. Okay, the restless tiny hands. He has a bunch of hands on him. Come on. Okay, failure. failure. He's not that great. Grasping tiny hands, knock your weapon away. Spend a surge, or spend an action to retrieve your lost weapon before it can be used again. Okay. So next turn you're going to have to do that. Wow. Wow, he's right. Moving in with the sword. Holy crud. All right, so we have the Vagabond set, we have the Black Sword, we have, so it makes us a mastery of the sword. Mm -hmm. Four speed. Uh, three per two perfect two hits. Two perfect hits, so that's two survival, but you're at max, right? Yeah, but on a perfect hit, I can make one additional attack roll. Oh my goodness, okay. Is it, is it, is not, is it twice? No, it's just that you roll an additional die now, so you roll two more dice. Why? Make an additional attack roll. Oh, okay. Two perfect hits. Does a two hit? I think uh, it does. I don't know, five... Five, four, because the the thing, right, the arrow. Four. 
I think this gives you plus one accuracy. Yes. So threes. threes. So no. So five hits. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Now you're allowed to roll once, right, and then, and then select where it goes. Where they go. Okay. Looking for a crit would be great, right? Crit. Okay, two. two well, that's hits. a wound. Two wounds. Okay, so let's not do anything. That's that a critical. That gives resources. Yep. That gives resources. That gives resources. That gives resources. That gives resources. Wow. Yeah. All right, we don't want to do that. All right, let's do this one. The gnarled horns. If the attacker is... It, oh, you didn't fail, so we don't matter. We didn't do the bell. We forgot the bell. We did forget the bell. We didn't put it on the board. That's why. You're right. All right, so it's one. Yep. Dang it. Um, let's do... We don't want to do that one. Here we go. Giant tongue. Eight. I maybe I shouldn't have done the giant giant tongue. You wound him. Blood and spittle erupt from the screaming antelope's wounded undermaw. If the wound roll result is even, suffer one brain damage. Oh, you still have insanity, right? No, I don't. Oh well, that sucks. Yeah, that's a heavy. All right. Well then, roll on the chart. Because we needed to ring the bell. Seven. Uh, plus two. <clears throat> so I got a heavy to the head, or heavy to the brain. You were knocked down and gained one d ten insanity. <sighs> Rest of the attack. That was fits. my. That was my fault. Six insanity. Well. Wasn't bad. Do can I, you pick me up like do I get you back up? I can pick myself up. Uh, if you have a ton, maybe. If not, I can. I'll, I'll pick you up. Go ahead. All right, surging. Surging. I'm moving all the spent ones over here. Okay. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I can't have ten. I have ten, but not anymore. We just got more perfect hits, right? More no, we hits. don't really want perfect hits. Yes, we do! That's a failure, right? But you get to reroll. You get an extra one. So four, and you gain that survival. Does that keep going? I, I think it just says make one additional attack. Oh, it says on a perfect hit, right? Yeah. Yes, I think it just keeps going. Because wow. it's a combo. Wow. It's like no. Killer Instinct. That's crazy. One, two, three. Okay. Four. Trap. Ooh, the screaming antelope panics, its undermaw unleashing an inhuman wail. It buckles widely and leaps into the air. The attacker is doomed. All survivors adjacent to the monster, we're not, it's just you, suffers two brain damage per monster level. So you suffer four. Okay. Knockback five. And are knocked down. The monster lands on its belly and begins to slide on its teeth. Turn the monster directly away from the attacker and full move... In a straight line. So he goes away from the attacker and goes like this. One, two, three, four, five. Goes down there. Okay. That's it. And if he collides with you, you would gain a disorder. Okay. Now, our settlement is romantic, right? We are not barbaric. That's correct. Okay. The tab root has an effect on it. Well. Okay. Uh, then I think all I'm going to do is move my tank out. Well, you don't have to get hit. He can just charge towards you, right? Yeah, but he was going to maybe come up here. Oh, oh So okay. I'm going to go like this, the and initial. we'll play on the first attack. Yeah. And I looked up something online. Um, it's better to shuffle like this. I think it's like three. I forget how many times you should riffle shuffle. It's like five or six times, and it's like a 1 out of 15,000 possibilities, whereas when you do this, this is actually riffle shuffling. It's like, you would have to do this for like right, right, three right. hours to equal that. Okay. So that's, I think, what we did that one time and got the trap on top. Alright. So we go over here now. Monster goes... Uh, full move in the direction the monster is facing, then turn to face the closest survivor. So it just spins around. Uh, pick target. Knockdown survivor in range 12. That's not you. Closest survivor in range 12. So that is me. So I'm just going to come to me like this. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. 
not knock down. So speed one, so two attacks, accuracy, hits on twos, one damage. This is silly. So I have, what was that, plus five evasion? No, more than that. Three, four, five, six, you're right. So hits on eights, one. Uh, it is two damage to the head. I'll, just, I'll take it. So four. And now it's going to... Um, charge. Charge. So it's going to come to me. Mm. Uh, I'm just going to dash out of the way. One, two, three, four. Like so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Like so. And what if I was knocked out? Is he still running to me? Yeah. Okay. Take two more damage. Wow. All right. So then you stand up, and it is our turn. I'm going to go hit him. Right with the sword. Okay. So it might run back that way. Somehow. Maybe. I'm not going to bring everyone here, and then he's going to mm -hmm. run. Four. Okay. All right. Roll first. Let's get a, start off with a nope. crit. All right. Wound the attacker. Disable the screen. Case my one moving so okay. All right, let's go with this. So the inner thighs, uh, you do a wound, and uh, the, your attack disables the monster's powerful running muscles. The screaming gains a minus one movement token. That's awesome. Keep him on the board, wherever it is. OK, why? No, no, there you go, oh. sorry. All right. I thought he was like stuck there. All right, next uh, one. Let's see, Let, let's actually. Okay, that's fine. This is fine. Okay, good. The, you're hitting him in the ear. That's Critical critical. Him. Critic him. All right. Critic him. Critical. Damage. If the monster would draw... Okay, so if persistent injury is dazed. If the monster would draw an AI card, roll a d10. On the result of eight or more, the screaming antelope is confused and instead makes a full move forward in a straight line. So he just... He forward. just moves forward. He doesn't run, he doesn't dash, he just moves forward. Well, he would trample over us. Okay. If he if he ever does that. But okay. yeah, he would just move forward. So that stays in play. That's not bad. All right. But no resource. Correct, no resource. That is a failure. Yeah. The giant maw snaps shut. Spend one survival to react quickly or suffer three damage to the arm. Yes, survival. You almost got caught by... Stop giving me these survival. Okay. All right, restless hoof. Six. That's a wound. Okay. I'm going again. Surgeon. Do it up. Time eight. Okay. Three. Three. Yeah, two doesn't hit. Yeah. All right. Get a crit. I want to get that screaming antelope. Oh, okay. Yeah. No. No. Okay. One wound. Uh, Are you picking uh, the best thing? Like, both of them have wounds on it. They, like, stop your attack. Okay. So let's do this one. All right. The shank. Let's just crit Good, him. crit. Gain one screaming antelope resource. Your attack wrecks one of the monster's legs. If insane, you're not. No. Oh, you would have gained. By one. By one. Uh, you would have gained permanent movement. Wow. All right. So if here's I the ring that bell. I know. Okay. Uh, Next so one. our first hide. Nope. <sighs> Bone. Like, when you gain this, what does it say? When you gain this, a star of your choice gains an insanity. So just give it to you. This guy's got Tarek. zero. Tarek. Okay. Good idea. All right. Now the shoulder. Still it's still a wound. Uh, Your blow clips the screaming antelope's shoulder and it jumps back. Turn to face the attacker, then without turning, move the monster one space directly away. Cancel okay. all hits. Here on out. Oh, cool. Uh, I can move one at the end of my turn, so I'm just going to get out of the way. Okay, smart. All right, uh, Tarek's got to get in there. So his first action has to pick up his weapon. Okay, so that's done. Yep, and then... You can move to him, right? Right. Um, one, two, three, four. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, you can, I think you can move through me. 
I think other survivors may move through but not end their movement in my space. All right, I'm gonna go right here. Then four. Yep. It's because I have the reach, so I can get two away. Spending a surge to attack. Good. Oh, uh, you don't need to spend a surge to attack. Oh yeah, I don't. They're sweet. My wrong person. You gotta get that one wound, Terry. That's a hit. Yeah, no, no perfect hits. Minus two toughness to wound this location. Oh, here it is. In the tongue. Here it is. Stab him. <laughs> I don't know if the camera got that, but that's a one. Oh, that was it. You know what? I think. Have you ever played Tarek before? No, he's, he's your usually character. my character, right? Yeah. 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 Look at he that. Yes, he is my character. That's your character, man. All right. I got the bone darts. I could try to, but it doesn't work with the spear. Yeah. No. No. Okay. All right. Well. That's it. That's it for me. All right. I'm going to cat eye. So we look pretty good. Reflex. Seven more wounds. You count of these? Eight, nine more wounds. Okay. And I'm going to surge. To do what? I'm um, going to just look at the top two cards. And I have not done his movement. Gain, research, gain surges back. Gain, you know what I mean? Oh, okay. Yeah, because yeah, you have the raw hide so you can get your survival back when you spend it. Alright, I just want to see what's coming up. Random survivor in range. Nope, closest survivor in field of view. We're going to do that. Well, he's in range. Tarek's in range. Yeah, yeah. I don't I don't want... Everyone's really in range. So yeah. I don't want it to be random. Right, okay. So I'm going to put... The tank is just going to move here. And um, I'm not, I'm not going to even fight. Okay. I'm just going to wait. Why? Because I want Can you block or something? No, I can't, actually. Okay. All right. Monster's turn. Closest survivor. Oops. In field of view. So it's actually... Tarek. Yep. Uh, I messed that up. I'm sorry, friend. I'm so sorry. Here you go. Two attacks. It's on twos. You have an evasion. I have two evasion. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, one hits you. One hits you. Yeah. So it's three damage to the body. I'm gonna. Why don't I? I would just dodge it. I have five. I'll have five armor left. You, you gain a bleeding token. I'll have five armor left. Okay. I only have six survival. Okay. Okay. So I'm gonna have to spend one to get out of the way of their charge. You're right, you're right. So, okay. I'll take it. That's fine. That's my fault. I'm trying to go through this too quickly. And we didn't even roll for this AI card. Alright, now he picks a random survivor and runs in that direction. So, uh, three, six, nine. So he's going to run this way. So we could both dash out of the way if we like. Which I'm going, going to. to. One, two, three, four. And then let's get down there closer, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think so you can get down there. Uh, do you go with Tarek first? Yes. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to go four, use the reach. Mm -hmm. You know what's really good when you use... Um, champion's well. right, and then your extra strength. Yeah. Remember when you failed that? Okay. Doesn't matter, the reflex. It does not matter. We're not in the zone of death. Oh my god, can you roll anything but a one? I know. My goodness. All right, well, bittersweet surge. It's free. It is free. Two perfect Two. hits. Doesn't do anything with them. Nope. Okay. Failure. All right, we don't want to do that. Uh, turn the survivor to face the attacker and full... All right, well, we'll do the wound result because we want you to at least wound. Come on. You need a six to wound. Well, what do you mean? If I wound him, he's going to hit he me. He runs away. Oh, he runs away. Okay. Yep. A one. Are you serious? All right, so that's a fail, so nothing happened. Now I have Roll to... Roll right here. 
I got it. Roll right here. Six. Six. That is a wound. That's a wound. Thank God. This would have been a failure, so. You are now, well, you will be at the end of this fight. Yes, you mark it at the end, right? You mark it at the end. Yeah. Okay. Woo. Now we can just kill this guy. Uh, yeah, because I wasn't trying that to begin with. <laughs> Alright, cool. Um, do Four, I start three, running up there with the sword, or do we five, just wait six, for him seven. to run back? He's got eight. Oh, because right now... One, two, three, four, five... I would go up there and attack three, him. Four, you've got, you've got top, max survival. Yeah. Just get up there. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, and he's actually, he's actually here. Okay. Uh, that would have... Ah, we would have done things differently. I'm going to keep him there. He has minus one movement. Okay. Um, so at the end of my turn, I can move one because I have the leather boots. So I'm moving here. Gonna move now. I'm gonna. Well, it's technically not the end of your turn because then you would end lose movement. out. Oh, it's the end of your movement or your oh, turn? Oh, at the end of your act. Yeah. Okay. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. That's and fine. then my end of turn here. Okay. Okay. So I'm gonna hit here. Mm -hmm. uh, there is a trap in here, but we'll be okay. Yeah. Who Two says hits. that? Good. Who says that? You always. Oh, they don't I'm just letting you know. There's, you know, there's, yeah, we're getting down to the end. Six. Um, how are we going to do this one? Because there's a reflex, of which we don't want that. Okay. Why oh, have champions right? Doesn't really help. Next one. Can you crit him? A miss. Wow. Turn the monster to face away from the tiger and full move towards the straight line. Away from, so he just moves this yep. way? Yeah, you got it. And then I move my one. Okay. Wow. I'm just, that's gonna... I'm just gonna move my tank up like this. Okay. Do you want to be in front of me? Yeah. Oh. Or do you mean like over here? Yeah. Yeah, let me go over there. That's fine. Okay. Monster switches. Monster's turn. Chow down. If there are no Acanthus plants on the Chow down board, discard Chow down. So there isn't. There are. Full move the Screaming Antelope. Oh, I'm sorry. We have to roll a d10. Okay, yeah. You part. should bring this utility person for picking these things up. I should. You're right. Okay, we're gonna do we're gonna do that. Full move the screaming animal to the closest of the campus plant. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. If the monster ends its movement on or adjacent to an acanthus plant, it consumes it. Nope. It does not. Place chow down on top of the monster AI deck instead of discarding it. So okay. we'll constantly be healing. But now he does this whole dash, which is towards me. So I'm just going to... Um... Actually, I'm going to take it. I only have two survival left. He goes all the way to the end. Right. Right. And I so take two damage to the waste. If you pick this Acanthus up, then he has to move to the other one. And he won't get it. So it's okay. another wasted turn. Okay. You know? But I that's think. if we don't do any wounds. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because it's me on top. Mm-hmm. Alright, so I'm knocked down. And a disorder, don't forget. No, that's only his trap. Okay. It's only his trap. Alright, so it's our turn. I'm gonna move. One, two, three, four, five. And I'm gonna do this because of trap cards. If you want. Or do you want me to do the campus? It's up to you. It's up to you. Trap. There's the next card. So do we have Tarek pull it? Maybe. You cancel it on a six? Uh, seven plus. Oh. Discard it, then reshuffle hit location. <clears throat> How do you discard it, then shuffle it? You know what I'm saying? Cancel the trap. Discard it, then reshuffle hit location. Yeah. yeah I'm not... Discard it meaning, meaning don't, don't actually don't play do it. it. Yeah. yeah. All right, Tarek, do you think you, you can do this? I don't know, maybe. Okay, I'm gonna I'm I'm gonna let you do it. Oh boy. Okay. I'm gonna let you do it. Uh He's gonna run now. But everyone within two. Everyone within two what? What do you mean? Would um they suffer brain damage. No. You're not within two, so you're fine there. Leo would take two. I would take a light over here. Well, then just cancel it. 
just cancel the trap. With the spear, you, you, you know... You complain that that's all it does. Complain? Yeah, because it's crap. This is your chance. I could throw a bone dart at it. I want that. <laughs> I'll be backed right, up. So I back up one. I, I, I still have reach. But I won't. Two is my reach. Mm. Doesn't matter. Just cancel it. Alright, do this correctly. I would shout get to get me up. And then... I'm gonna go with her, so I don't get hit with it too. I could block too. Oh, it matter. Okay. Oh, because you're doomed. No, doomed. You can't block. It it is not hit. So oh, it's okay. just like an automatic okay. effect. Yes, we shout to get me up. Um. Yeah, shouting. And then I'm gonna go with her. One, two, three. Four. I'll just move over here. Actually, it's gonna run this way. Whatever. Yeah, I can't those planes. You're gonna move again with this person? Mm -hmm. You're not gonna surge? To... You're good? You're yeah. gonna surge with this guy? Oh no, don't spend the survival. Yeah, I'm good for now. Mm. Okay. Alright. Do what you're made for. Alright, so I'm gonna back up one, because I can. Okay. Or do I... Go like here? I think... Oh no, because mm -hmm. if he runs, he'll be this way. Alright. Yeah. All right, I'm just gonna back up one, because I... Or do I save my movement? I'm moving one. Okay. Here we go. With the spear. One hit. Okay. Got to roll. Seven plus. You you stopped it. <laughs> okay. Uh, you're doomed. All serves adjacent to the monster. So good. You oh, good, up. good, good. Good job. Um, then he turns like this. Oh, directly away from the attacker. There you go. Beep. That's it. Doesn't do anything. Yes. You did the right thing. That's so it turns away from the attacker and runs in a straight line. If unless you're next to it. If you're next to it, you suffer two brain. Okay. Knock back five. Okay. And that's then, why he hit, he hit her. Yep. But with the reach, we're good. And now it just goes away from you. And then if you got hit by him now, oh yeah, now just go in there and mess him up. Yeah, I'm gonna. Um, I'm just gonna surge for free. Uh, movement, you would have to spend survival, and okay. then you can get a free attack in. No, I either can move or attack. Right. Well, you haven't dashed yet. Right. So you would have to dash to get there. And then, oh, okay, yeah. And then you get your free attack. Yes. Do I? Stay here, or do I move to the side? Do we try to... Um... Oh yeah, we're in the very bottom corner. Oh, we're still there. Oh. Oh my god. Oh god, oh Jesus. I didn't even know it could do that. Okay. We're gonna have to end it out my hands I Honestly, I think you actually go with her first. Yeah? Because now the traps, you know. Okay. Two, three, four. Okay. All right. Not cutting it. Believe in you. No oh, thanks. Four. One extra. Your perfect hits are nine or ten, right? Nine. Or, why would they be nine? I don't know. No. Okay, so they're just tens. Yeah. So four hits. Trap. What would make a perfect hit a nine? Timeless eye, right? Right. Okay. All right, trap. You take two insanity. I have it. Knock back five. Knock down. Turns away, runs into the wall. Boom. It was the second car. Okay. I'm going to shout. Or should you have the utility person shout? Yeah, I'll shout. Okay. And get it back. Okay. So you're up. Are you good dashing in? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so by you picking me up with a tabard, I get a survival. So I'm dashing in and surging. So it's two extra survival. Let's do this again. Four more speed. Okay. All three. Uh, four, four, right? 
Good. All right. Get that first critical. Let's do this crit. Two. That's Ooh, a hit. Okay. That's a hit. That's a hit. You're right. Uh, turn the Screaming Sparrow to face the attacker. Oh, we don't want to do that. Let's get rid of the failure. All right. Yeah, please. All right. What's the next one? What's the next one? Uh, let's see. We want the Restless Muzzle. Wound. That's a wound. We have we have this luck, and we're just not getting it. I know. Well, last fight. The really, back. It really helped us last fight. Okay, and now the Restless Chest. Wow. Wound. Turn the Screaming Sarah to face the attacker. Full move forward in a straight line. I can't. Oh, I already dashed. So what happens to me now? You take two damage, and you just fall down. Fall down here? Yep, and take two damage. So one... Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Two yeah. damage where? Random? Random. Waste. Down to three. All right, I'm gonna just have these guys go pick up Acanthus plants. Okay. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. D10 on the campus plan. Oh. Two! I take an arm damage. Oh, oh goodness. Alright, and then the tank goes here. Eight. Okay. That is. Oh, oh eight. Yeah, first Acanthus. Awesome. At least you, you, the two still removed it from the board. Yeah. Cool. That's good. I mean, it doesn't matter because he's going to go over here, but whatever. Mm -hmm. Alright, uh. I you can, I guess, just move closer with Tarek? Oh, no. No, because you already did your turn the first yeah. half, right? Yeah, both my guys are done. Okay. Uh, it is the monster's turn? Yeah. Done to uh, three wounds. Three wounds! Survivor in field of view. That's the tank, thank goodness. Tank. And these attacks don't, they don't, they just tickle. Yes. One hits for three damage. To the hands. I'll take it. Wow. Yeah, but you, only, yep. you only have, what, two survival left? Yeah, I'll take yeah. it. I do gain a bleed. Uh, and then he charges me. One, uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I'm just going to dash. One, two, three, four, five. And I'm going to dash. One, two, three, four, five. Why are you going I can't get both of them. Oh, okay. He's going to die this turn, I would think. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, and then he goes like this. Spend the one. Do I get the other one back? I do. Okay. Our turn. Uh, I'm going to start here. Yep. So I'm looking for an eight. Nope. I think I just... Game one survival. And then here. Yeah. Yes. All right, cool. So that is an extra acanthus plant, can't survival, and you are. I'm up. Yep, on our you're turn? picked up. Okay. Can you get over there? I doubt it. One, two, three, f one, two, three, four, five. One, two, five. No. One, two, three, four, five. At the end of my turn. So you can move five. End your turn. Yeah. Get the extra space, then dash then and attack. Dash. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. All right, so I end my turn here with the leather boots. I can move one. Now okay. I'm going to dash. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. I am going to surge. Get it back and just look at the top three. Okay, you're good to go. Hopefully. You're good to go. Well, if I get four. We've got right? one crit, right? This whole time. The whole time. Four, right? Uh, one, easier. two, three, four. All right. Please get one critical right away. Well, no, we got a crit on the um, something else. Aww. But it didn't Monster help. turns to face the attacker. Oh, it's a crit, crit, crit. Not a crit, so let's do this one. Does anything happen when he hits the stone face because he collided with oh, it? Oh, he does it. He's actually, ooh, he's actually up here. Ugh. So you can't get there, can you? No. So that all I'm gonna gets... I'm going to put this back. Oh my goodness. I'm going to put this back. Uh, 
Well, here's at the end of my act. Oh, I only get one act. It's not yeah. like I can surge. Okay. Well, maybe I just go back and I don't do the one, two, three, four, five. I don't do the move. Well, if no one's. Um, hmm. Because I can't do anything else. Okay, yeah, go back. What I'll do is I'll, I'm going to dash and head up here. Didn't? Okay. Let me get back. Okay. I mean, I moved here. If I dash, one, four, five. I yeah, can't do, I can't do anything. That's fine, because he's going to move anyway. And then Tara can go one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Like, do we bring Tara in there? To, he can't. Three wounds is going to be really rough. Yeah. Or do we just try it? Sure. You know, like then he's gonna be the closest target. Uh, then I would just, then I would just stay back. Or I would maybe just move in, just in case we need him for next turn. Okay. But not be lined up, yeah. Yeah. And then they're two away, so they're fine. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Okay. Good. All right. I'm gonna roll to see if he gets dizzy, and he does. Sweet. Uh, instead, make a full move, oh, in a straight line. That was the other crit. Remember, I got that crit that gave us mm, that dizzy right. for the days. Okay, at the end of the monster's turn, target a random survivor in the if full, otherwise move in direction the monster is facing. Great. That's it. Okay. Our turn. Still can't get there. But you could try two, to get that three, at Kansas. Four, five. One, two, three. You could do it now. The okay. same setup. Right so I'll start the Acanthus here. Leona, she finds... She gets her in the arm. Four, five. Moving five. Ending my act. Mm -hmm. Let's move the camera. Uh, we're, the antelope moves all over the board. I'll teach you how to do that once. There you go. What do you have? Tighten it. Super tight. All right, so I'm end of my turn, so I get the moon, moon with the blood of the boots, and then I'm gonna get dash. in there. One, two, three, four, five. Cool. Or do I go one, two, three, four next to him? Okay. Or behind him? Behind him, so get him to run that way. Yeah, but if he hits me into the face, yeah, you won't. You won't. Because you're gonna wow. kill him right now. All right, and then I'm. I have to surge. Yes. I don't want two. Okay, so three. Here's your chance to get a crit. Okay. There That's it is. a crit. And we get the pick, so... Whoa. 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 We're doing Whoa. the Restless Shank. Game one, Screaming Antelope Resource. Just grab it from the top. Yeah. Another bone. Oh, come on. Your attack wrecks one of the, the monster's legs. If insane... Who is this? No. Okay. Done. Next one. Ready? Uh, ready. This one. Six. That's a wound. Reflex. He turns the face. Here. Oh no. One wound left. Oh, that's each turn. That's it. Uh, that's a silly. I guess makes sense. Critical doesn't matter. Oh really? Doesn't hit. Did you roll a one? I think I rolled a one. Why? No, nothing, nothing happens, oh. actually. That's just... Well, that's the end, because I did all my stuff. <laughs> wow. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Get in there. Just kill him. Using my reach. Yep. And just dash. I'm going to take this from you. Thanks. Um, okay, here we go. Yep. Oh! No, I don't want to use a founding stone. Nah. Doesn't do anything. Hmm. But I'm going to surge. Well, what? I wonder if we use the founding stone. I'm thinking it's a crit. We have four of them. We've got four founding stones. Yeah, but we don't know if we fight that last guy. It's like, if you get a crit on this. Could, yeah, could because then each each one of us could go with a founding stone. Well, you're not going to carry I don't need one for here, here, because I got the death pack. I don't know if we're actually going to have the gear grades for it, because say we use a founding stone here instead of the lantern. 
Right. But we're going to then miss, mess up the affinities, which, which we use. But I don't is, think they use affinities for this. That person. Oh, for ignore that. Ignore the first yeah. severe injury. That's important. You give you plus one evasion, which is okay. But I, I don't mind you using it, and then I will use my head my headband, or, you know, this. This is gone. To at least pull a critical up here. I'm cool with that. But then we have... I'm trying to think like gear grid. If you're thinking long term... Yeah. You're not carrying a founding stone. Will you be carrying a founding stone on this person? I know. Mm. What are you going to get rid of on that person? Yeah, you're right. Nothing. Unless my heart. So yeah, let's use it. I could get yeah, like you know, let's yeah. let's do it. All right, so I'm going to use the okay thing. Let's see. There you go. They're all the same. So okay. let's. There's no death blow. So let's let's well, get him in the tongue. The wound dies. Okay. So that's it. It's automatic. Automatic hit. Automatic crit. Oh okay. Oh, wow, you're going to make me... Don't tell me it's a bone. It's a high! Yes! That's All right, good job. So we just need to pull... He's dead. One more. He's dead, so he's no more wounds. Done. All right, if for some reason we get to keep Somewhat these... Somewhat of an easy fight, we just didn't get the rules we were wanting. Right. But no one was in danger. Right, right. Uh, one, two, three, four... Bones, bones, bones. One hide. hide. Okay. Well, we don't pick... We don't keep these. I don't think so. Are you just putting them out there just because? Just in case. To help just get me all get excited them. that we got a hide. Alright, so we need one hide from here. I'm gonna pick two from the top. Okay. Bone and organ. organ. I'm gonna give the rest to you. How many? Four? We got four more. Wow, let me just give you this hide. Organ. Bone. Bone. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold well, on. Wait, we get to pick one. We you do get to pick one. But does that count towards the six? No, it does not. Oh, okay. So pull one more, and then we get to No, pick. I'm going to pick one first. I'm pull it out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pull it randomly, and then we get to go through okay. the deck and pick All one. All right. Hide. Nope. <laughs> you better go in that deck and find out. Oh, uh, they're the last three. Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe that. We couldn't know. Um... Wow, yeah. Someone shuffled them, Greet. The bottom three cards are all hide. Good thing you were reminded about this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think it's the safe bet to just build the set. And oh, completely, it. completely. That way we have, everyone has a set of armor. Right. Because we could, we could get this person um, like, a, like a piece of mail. Hmm. And it'd be great. They would get a lot of armor. But just to be immune to bash, I think is pretty helpful. Yes. Right? Okay. Back to the settlement. We have four endeavors. Um, and we go right to a random event. Right. Oh, no, sorry, gain experience. You leveled yes, up, I think, leveled right? Yes, up. Caitlin levels up. She's the, be the first level. All right, so she can now gain weapon proficiency and 2d10. Oh, two. I put it all in the one. You did. Okay, you sure did. Random fighting art. Okay. Yeah, right here. Right? Uh, Rumble uh, has to get one, too, from before. Okay. So, uh, do Caitlyn's first. Berserker. Berserker. Okay. And then... Rumble from earlier. My goodness. I'm not doing a crazy shuffle. Okay. Just gonna pick randomly. Berserker. Trailblazer. Okay. I don't know what that is. Mm, I forget. The hunting party may start the hunt phase one space closer. Oh. At the start of the showdown, all survivors gain one survival and one sanity. Okay. That's pretty good. That's helpful. Uh, no other roles that we need to do, right? That was the age. Well, age, terror, retires. Oh, yeah. All right. Okay, yeah. So he retires, and he became weapon master. Yes. For spears. Right. So what does that do? Nothing good. The spear is like the worst. I mean, every other weapon gives you, you know, a strength, a speed. Uh, a, you can do something, something fun. The spear, um, whenever a spear master hits a monster with a spear, they may spend one survival to gain the priority target token. If they are made, if a hit is made from behind another survivor, that survivor instead then gains priority token. And everyone can then get the, the specialization, which is if you attack with a spear, you can ignore a trap if you pull it with a seven plus on a roll. This is the worst. I'm sorry. 
It's, it just doesn't matter. It, you didn't even pay attention. This is the worst weapon specialization. I did not pay attention. And it's a shame because spears you usually think are pretty cool, they range, and they have crap. It's like pulling aggro. You're like provoking the monster. Yeah, but I... But the thing is our tank doesn't use weapons. We have our a dodge tank. tank. Yeah, we have a dodge right. tank. So, it's garbage. That is garbage. Uh, does Tarek have a lot of disorders? He's got uh, two. He's got Quixotic and Weak Spot Body. Okay, so... He goes Storm. He's going to be a Storm okay. thing because of the Weapon Master. So you can remove all permanent injuries and gain Vestophobia, which, again, you can't use armor in your vest, in your chest. Okay, no. So the only way we can get rid of that is by using... Drums. Drums, but, again, we're chanting it. Quixotic is pretty good, and Weak Spot Body means I have to wear armor in my chest. Right. So that's not bad. So, yeah, the other one was be remove all disorders and gain the broken jaw severe head injury. No one wants that. Right. Well, it's either... We're no chance. one wants that. This is crap. Like, you do so well, and then it's, you know what, you did really well, too bad, I don't care. Like, reward me a little bit. I can't, you can't shout to pick people up. That's what it is, right? Draw. Yeah. Okay. This is garbage. Shout to draw. Yeah, you no longer encourage... It's either that or we chance with Vestophobia. I say we burn this game to the ground. <laughs> I, I, the only, the best thing is then to, well, if you think about it, the tank is going to be spending their survival to dodge, to move. They probably will not be picking people up. Right? Right. So I, don't, I think that would be a, a, a better way. But I don't want to lose these disorders. I would like to keep Quixotic. Well, again, Quixotic gives you plus one strength. He's not attacking. Yeah, I guess. So. Okay. That's that, I think. Right, 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 right. So, yeah. Um, Quixotic and Broken Jaw. So, I mean, you lose that and just gain a Broken Jaw. Okay. And then you get Storm. Okay. Which, Which then fix everything. Doesn't okay. it? So maybe we do the best of Phobia. Does it fix everything? I think so. Because we got it in the last one, we're like, oh, remember, because you get to do this when you go people the storm. I think not people the storm, people the stars. You get to heal all disorders, and something or something. Not this one. No. Uh, which one was it then? We've only have storm, maybe storm and gambler. Is it in the book when you become a person of the storm? Well, that's the thing. Yeah, you you remove all disorders mm -hmm. and suffer the broken jaw, okay. or remove all permanent injuries and gain vestophobia. Permanent injuries, destroy gaping chest wound, and destroy genitals. So I guess we go with disorders. Yeah, only because we want him to have a full set of armor. Right. So. Okay, so healing all his disorders, which weren't, broken even, jaw. which weren't even that bad. Injury. That's like when you level up and you get the white, you go blind. Like, I'm no, right. I know, no. I don't want to go. You're so happy by getting there. Yeah, bed won't even rest, broken jaw. Mm -mm. You would think you would be able to... Let me use this, this muscly gums from the antelope to put in there. Alright, so that's all set. Storm, we know uh, you gain the Destin Disorder. And plus one permanent speed. Which isn't going to help us at all. Yeah. And then this is if you, you gain weapon proficiency during the aftermath game plus three instead. Which would be sweet if you can do, but it doesn't, mm, it would be cool because if we get a fist, fist the two times we were getting there. Well, you know what? Well, he, no, we already have someone that's, Acid yeah, palms, oh no, but that, but they're not, not mastered ten. yet. Yeah. So he would have to go out on one fight to have enough for the final fight. It might be worth, worth it. We're finding a level three nemesis, and then the Lion God. Right. You Both easy to... people. <laughs> All right, and we gain plus one iron. Okay. So we have seven iron now. Yeah, to do nothing. With. To do nothing. You're right, because... Because who cares? We can't build the whole armor because we need a ton of resources. For yeah. It. And they're taking... You know, it's really like, oh, you know what? We're going to we're gonna give them something. Well, we can do this. If we get this, you're never going to get that. Right. You know? and that, I think they're talking about extending the campaign because you don't really have a chance to gain the blacksmith armor. 
Right. It's so late game by the time you get there. It's like now we're getting stuff, but they're taking all our basic stuff away. Mm -hmm. You know, so now we're we're trying to piece things together and we're trying to do the best we can. That's why we're going right. with the leather set. We've had the leather since since like yeah. the second week of That's the game. What, and they've introduced more armor sets throughout the game and armor sets as in like it combines which is awesome. a few pieces from armor, a few pieces from this. Which the Vagabond set, which is what we have, yeah. works really well. That's really cool because you're not set into sticking to one thing. Yes. You know, so I'm glad they're eventually doing that. All right, so now we have to do our... No, we gained in Vedevers. Yep, yep. So we have Draw four. a settlement event. Okay, that's what we're doing next. First one. Elder Council. I don't actually remember this. The elders of the settlement gather... This is our people of stars. To gather to reminisce over their hard-won scars. Count the total number of hunt experience among all survivors. Oh my gosh. Add the bonuses and consult the table below. Wow. Oh my gosh. I don't even know where these guys are. Okay. Because this is... I've never seen this. Alright. Uh. Give me some people. The rest of mine are all dead. <laughs> some of them. Thirty-seven here. Thirty-one. So, sixty-eight. 68. Okay. Sixty-eight. Do we have Saga? Scarification or Records? I don't think we have any of those. Who's that? Who's that over there? Did you count that person? Nope. Nocturne. He's got two. Seven. Seventy. What's, is, that, is that something, or is that just paper? Okay. Now I'm like you know we gotta get to make you have a our main, you you got our three mains right yeah What's I there, right in there. Mm -hmm. okay so we have seven day all right let's see elder council scarification of records I don't think like I said we have them we don't because those would add a d10 oh all right wow. 51 to 99. Oh boy, yeah. No. And then there's 100 plus, which is wow. the best. All right, well, 51 to 99. Minus one endeavor. Minus two resources. An elder decides to hunt again. A retired survivor must join the next hunting party. I don't... No, it's stupid. That is so stupid. So Tarek has to go out on the next fight to fight a level three nemesis. Well, that's how he's going to gain his punch. <laughs> oh my god! But now we have to now we have to beat a level three nemesis. Yeah, we've done it before. I don't think we've ever fought one. We've fought many things harder than a level three nemesis. A level no, two antelope haven't. destroyed it. Wow, that's going to change a lot. It's going to add a lot of pressure. A level 3 butcher. Beat him. A level th maybe a level 3 hand. What did we fought level we, 4. What did we just fight? That was level 4 manhunter. Like he Easy. was he's special. Yeah. He goes up to level 4. I don't maybe a level All right. What level 3 nemesis can we fight cuz we have to bring out Wow, that is horrible. We have to bring Tarek out so he has to survive. He could run, but we're fighting. We're going to fight, and Tarek's going to try and prove himself. We're going to fight it. Well, we have, like, nine evasion with Tarek. Yeah, because he's got plus two. And he's got his fist. Yeah. I'm going to read what the 100, 100 plus does. Please. Okay. You may spend one endeavor. If you do, the council passes its wisdom on. Nominate a survivor with at least with one or less on experience. Age one and age two. That survivor may gain these benefits again when they reach their hunt XP milestones. So that's even crap too. That's even crap. This elder council, we bought him the ring. Too bad it's not like they may go out on the next hunt. No, he's like, I'm going out. We would add 24, even including our dead people. So that would put us at 94. Yeah. Still would not have been hard enough. Nope. Like, how do you, how? 
that would have to be like the last thing in the game. Because it's not even like, you know, everyone that goes out is getting hunt experience. Right, you're right. Oh, no. Because they, they, oh, yeah. they wouldn't have died. Some of them died in a fight. They would have got that hunt experience instead. True. Maybe it would have been really close. Really, really close. Really. Yeah, you're right. All right Some so, of them we just sent out to die, so. All right, the tomb. So that's one less endeavor. Okay, well. All right, the tomb. Part three. Overwork and lack of rest takes their toll. This lantern year archive all basic resources brought back by returning survivors. Mm. If there are fewer than four people of the stars in the settlement, any survivors with zero hunt experience die. Wow. Holy, we just cut. We wow. just made that. Wow, okay. All right. The departing survivors hide avoiding the labor. They heal all broken, severe injuries. So people going out in this next fight. Broken There's jaw. Broken jaw. Okay. Yep. They heal all broken severe injuries and gain plus two luck tokens. Okay. Oh. That's going to be helpful. Super helpful. The okay. And that's it. Oh. Add tomb part four to the next year on the timeline. Okay. So. Well, what's it? It's a shattered jaw. It's not broken jaw. All broken severe injuries. That's broken hip. Broken it's, rib. It's, um, I think it is broken jaw. Okay, we'll have to look at it. All right. Yeah, it's just worded differently in a few different places. That's helpful. Yeah. Uh, but we are have to, we are risking him to go out. Not risking nothing. Plus two tokens, that's going to be good. All right, so again, yes, let us know what people you think we should fight. We've got the butcher, the hand, and the, the knight guy, the kingsman, Not which the, he sucks. The... It's hard. Who was the guy we just ran away from the whole time? The that hand. was the hand. That was a boring fight. It's boring, but it ends. You just have to... But he can, like, just one shot and kill people. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Okay. We don't get anything good from, from beating... Well, I don't know about a level three. Who knows? Okay. So that is that. Um, we have no extra stories. Death count. Timeline we did. I just have to check it off. Okay. Uh, so the only things we're building right now is completing our leather set that we talked about. Because um, we'll decide on what weapons that we want at a, at a later point in later years. Right, right. We're not going to build anything at, at the moment. Um, unless, maybe we decide depending on who we fight. We'll see, yeah. We'll add. So right now we're, we're spending, so we only have three endeavors. We're spending one to create leather. Uh, so that goes there. And then th these are resources that we had. Like I said, we have three hide to start with, so now we have zero hide after this. We've lost all of our basic, and we've got two endeavors two left. You made the thing you want to send Vane. Oh, actually, I actually only have one left. Three. No, you're right. Yeah, two. Yeah! She's actually pretty... He wants to send Vane, because all she needs is a scar to become a witch. Another person in the star. We already have four, but you never know. Why not have five? But going up to meet the guy at the throne... She could die. Hey, man, a three, three, four, five, or six, she gained Scar. And she's a witch. It, I say let's try and have five. That's up to you, man. I, yes. Yes. She's champion right, unbreakable. She has tumble, acid palms. Let's get her there. She deserves a shot to become. If you call it a shot, then you, 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 you're in charge. I'm okay with you okay. making this decision. Okay, it's going to be weird trying to aim for, like, a low-range number. You want a middle number? Yes. A middle number is probably better to aim for. I'm aiming for a five. Okay. How do I roll for a five? Let's see, let's see. This is a five roll. Just like that. All right, good, good, good. Six! Six! Okay. The survivor stumbles down the gleaming stairs, clutching their dis disfigured face. They suffer... The blind, severe head injury. No, you don't want that. I know, it's minus one accuracy. Where is, where is she? Right here. Bane. So, uh, minus How one How are you accuracy. blind? But, oh, because you get a scar over the eye. Yeah. Ah, blind. But I can heal a permanence. But I would gain bestophobia. Mm -hmm. But maybe we can gamble on her. Okay, okay. Oh, because you wanted these drums. That's what the other one Right. Yeah. And then gain scar. Which is which? So we haven't witch. seen this we before. We haven't seen which before. All right, so 
I'm going to do, do the it. gamble, right? Because we have to pick beforehand. Uh, what do you mean? Oh. So let's get rid of all of our permanents, which is pretty bad. Yeah, because it's minus one movement, minus one strength, minus one accuracy. That would all go away. Because she's blind, constructor, it, something I, else. These stats don't stay even. They, they go with the injury? Yeah. Okay. So if you heal the injury, you're going to heal that, let's too. Let's do that. Okay, so I'm going to get... So you're she not going to send her on the next fight if we miss drums. We're not needing her next no, fight. No, okay. right. So she gains Vestophobia. Which means she has to wear... Ch she can't wear chest armor. She can't armor. wear chest armor. But she doesn't wear it anyway because she's utility. Right, I just you know, want to be able to... Right. right. All right, so I'm getting rid of blind, so I recover my accuracy. Um, can you tell me the other two? I think... I look... This happened to Nocturne. Yeah, arms. Minus one permanent accuracy. Wait, no, contractor. contractor. Yeah. yeah, so that gets erased. And then intestinal pro prolapse. Yep. Um, I... Oh. Uh, no longer equip any gear on your waist. Oops. So she couldn't have had the, the armor anyway. So, you know what? Erase all of her... Um, survival? Survival. Okay. Because she wouldn't have been able to rejuvenate it. Right. Okay. Well, that's all cleared. But now she's got Vestophobia. And Witch. Yeah, and Witch. Did you chew this pencil to I... sharpen it? <laughs> all a right. smooth white face with round black eyes stares down at you. That does look like Vane from League of Legends. If you kind of think about it, she's kind of like white. She's like a vampire hunter kind of deal. Okay, good okay. call. Right? Will you ever play that game again with me? No. Its mouth, a veined triangular trunk. A vein? A veined triangular trunk, and its ears adorned with humans in per perverse poses. Oh, yeah. A glance changes you forever. Below the soft, bulging skin of your cheek grows an eye looking into the past. Gain. Plus one permanent speed. Wow. Ready Great for, for utility. Plus one permanent luck. Great for utility. Well, maybe she won't go utility. With a permanent luck, she might be an attacker. And then an ability. Presage. Each time you attack, before drawing hit locations, loudly say a name. You lightly bite the eye in your cheek to see what it sees. If you draw any hit locations with that name... Gain three insanity and plus ten strength when attempting to wound them. That's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. So you could use it like the circle it and then shoot. Yeah. All right, let me see that second right there. That is pretty cool. Well, I'll just keep witch out with her. Yeah. Hey, now we got five people. Right, right. That's right. again. I thought it was gonna be tough for us to get three. We made it. All right, and now we're just going to use drums to try and get rid of her disorder. Right. Why don't you roll the drums? No, you were doing really well. Sure. Six. I think it's just gaining insanity. I don't know. Who's doing drums? Vane. Okay. Oh, yeah. yeah. Where did you put that? You should ball. have played the heart flute <laughs> to, no to pick, a, pick a person, pick a thing to fight. Drums, five through eight, gain of survival. Okay. You need a nine plus. Hmm, yeah, that's right. All right, well, she may be an attacker with luck. But she's another Let's another see. person. It's another option, right. yeah. Okay, so that, I thought it was just going to be basic gear, but actually a lot happened. A lot happened. A new person, uh, well, two new people, the stars. Yeah. So we are set for the final fight, but unfortunately we do have to fight uh, a nemesis encounter. But let's go in and... and We're going to go in and win. Let's go and kill him. As always, we always go in and win. We don't... We're going to go in and him. win. And, uh... I would love to fight a butcher, but he can ramp up. Ridiculous. We'll figure it out. Maybe someone can help us plan what we you know, think of a strategy. Cool. What to do. Well, as always, thanks for watching. There are three episodes after this one. Three more. And we might have a special thing Yeah, to next mention. episode, probably. Not that but Definitely. Special. Definitely something cool. I think it's cool. I think it will be. You think it's cool? It's a good idea. Yeah. For everyone that's been watching us since the beginning. Yeah. So, as always, thanks for watching. Post 
some comments, uh, and a thumbs up. And yeah, thanks for subscribing. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for commenting, not just because it shows activity, but because you're giving um, us tips. Yes, you're, helping you're helping us out. You time. are with us to the end. Hopefully, hey, if you've watched my first campaign, you know what happened at the end of that. So, uh, yes, I hope I hope it's different this time around. It's gonna be right. Good, because you're here, right? Yes. And you're the best attacker ever. You proved it tonight. Yes. With Tarek. With we we won. Did we not? We won. We'll we won. Time.